when did it begin for you? Um, what's, this, what's your story? So I became a vegetarian in July 2010 and then a vegan in that same year in November. I found out what happened in the slaughterhouses and I've never been a big animal lover or anything but I just couldn't, I, it just didn't sit well with me after I realized where my meat was coming from. Eventually it became also for physical reasons. I started realizing I feel better, I feel lighter, I, I can run better, all these things. Like I need less sleep, my skin looks better, everything. I, and then I started realizing there's probably some legitimacy to all the claims that it's really good for you physically to not eat meat. Um, and then I started learning about the health benefits, like decreased risk of cancer, heart disease, stroke, everything. It's honestly the most sustainable lifestyle that anybody could have. Um, I can safely say that I'm contributing less to global warming than any of my meat-eating friends, regardless of if they use energy-saving light bulbs or drive energy-saving cars. It's just the livestock industry contributes more to global warming than all modes of transportation combined. So it's amazing because with this lifestyle choice, it's just becoming more and more affirmed to me as time goes on that I'm making the right choice for myself, for the planet, for the animals, for everything. And what about the website that we're putting on? So we're making a website called Villanova Vegans and it's gonna, it has a lot of information on the benefits of a plant-based whole foods diet, like the health benefits, the environmental benefits, pretty much everything I just mentioned. And it also talks a lot about how to be a vegan on campus. You know, we're giving recipe suggestions and suggestions if you do eat in the dining halls. So, yeah, it's just kind of a way to get people started if they are interested or just to educate people if they're interested in finding out more about a vegetarian or vegan diet. And how are the dining halls here? Dining Services is really good about responding to our speak out suggestions. So it honestly just took one suggestion. All I said one time was, oh, you know, I'm a vegan and it's a little difficult. If you guys could just like add hummus to the salad bar, that would be great. Like I asked for something so simple and within the couple of weeks after that, I realized, oh, there are so many vegan options that we didn't have before just because like one student said something which really blew my mind um, and I'm just really impressed with all the work that dining services does in the dining halls you can you always have access to you know a great salad bar and you know some ethnic options like Indian food um, is featured really I'd say almost on a daily basis in the dining halls which is really great there's usually a vegan soup um, something like the black bean burger you know there's brown rice pasta that you can get the vegetarian bar in Doherty, I'd say, is probably one of the best places to eat as a vegan on campus. I can't imagine knowing what I know now and feeling the way I feel now and eating any other way. It's just, it's not only the way I eat, but it's come to, I don't know, it, for me it's, I feel like my morals are grounded in this. Like I, I feel, it just feels right to me to live this way and I, I really can't imagine living any other way. Do you feel more connected to Earth? I do, absolutely. I can actually look at an animal and say, you're so cute and I know that I wouldn't eat you. I can, I can look at the world around me and recognize that I'm contributing to its flourishing and not its destruction. And that's just such a great feeling. I'm getting emotional. <laughs> I'm getting emotional. Well, that's it here. We could.